This is Mrs. Jellynick. She's gorgeous. She's one lady who really knows how to take care of herself. And this is Mrs. Carmody. She's a private eye. Oh, and by the way, I'm Joe, the cook. I take care of Mrs. Jellyneck and Mrs. Carmody, which is quite a challenge, because when we all get together, it's murder! luck like it was your job. Bobby pins are why I wear a Gibson girl hairstyle. Lord Summerhall should be settling into his cell right about now. Constable McIntyre said Lord Summerhall had a record sheet about a mile long. Lady Elizabeth didn't know who she was marrying. A crook, a villain, and a murderer. Now where, the ladies of Summerhall Hill House, you were next in Lady Summerhall's family line. Fortunate for us, but we do need to get back to the city and see what other crimes need to be solved. That's one thing you can count on. There'll always be more murder. Lovely evening, Mrs. Carmody, Mrs. Jellyneck. I wonder. Cook. Now that Summerhall Hill House will be closed for the season, would you like to accompany Jilly, Nick, and I back to London and work for us there? I'd love to, on one condition. You must call me Joe, short for Joanna. Right you are, Joe. A classic move. I'm sorry, I don't follow. Mrs. Jellynick, Mrs. Carmody, thank goodness. Constable McIntyre said I'd find you here. Baroness Ipswich, whatever's the matter? A murder, most hideous, next to the curiosity shop. <gasps> Please, London needs you to solve this horrible crime. There'll always be more murder. Jellynick, will you join us, Joe? Of course. Let's be about it. Let's be about it! it.